What's up guys, welcome back. Today marks the first, right? We have something and this video will be out on the official release date of the 151 UPCs. So I am super happy that we actually got this a day early, right? Cause this is, this is definitely a first for us. Um, but I'm super stoked to get into this. This thing just looks awesome from the outside. Uh, Ellie and I were just talking about it. It looks a lot better than the last UPC that they put out. Like this has actually got like a little cutout right here, as you can see underneath the plastic. Um, I'm, I'm super excited to actually open this. I want my Mewtwo promo. Um, let's hope that the centering and the quality isn't absolute poop like most of the, uh, the 151 ETBs we have with the Snorlax. Those are just depressing. So let's hope that these are in a better condition. I would very much like to get one and uh, have it in a 10 from PSA. So without further ado, does this bad boy just slide right off? Yes, it does. Let's go. Nice. Okay, so full disclaimer, we have a second one that we're going to open today, right? One's just not enough, right? Got to work and try and finish that master set. Dude, the whole top pops on this. Let's go. I'm going to try and do this without hitting the camera. Oh, man. Dude, that's laid out beautifully. We'll tip this back. Oh, try not to knock over everything that we have. We get the Mew, the Mew EX, and the Mew 2. So let me pull this out. We're definitely going to look at these first. Uh, I'm very excited for these. Absolutely gorgeous. That metal card is flawless. Oh man, I lied, there's some schmutz on it. Oh, schmutz rubbed off, we're good to go. And then of course, the, the homie chilling off to the side, dude. Super excited. Uh, how do I, oh, that's like a little, a little like a little kickstand if you just wanna display the whole thing. We don't wanna do that, I want these cards. How do I get them out? What? <laughs> What's going on here? Is that being silly? Is this not a kickstand? Side, does it open? What in the... I mean, the Mewtwo's are already kind of popping out. Let's see. Oh, bang. Push that sucker out. Sorry, I know that was off screen. I'm sitting here trying to figure out my life. Like I never opened a freaking UPC before. Oh, man. That's... That's nice. That metal card, that's real nice. I don't remember the the Pikachu or the Charizard from the, the 25th anniversary celebrations. I don't remember those having such a such a textured appearance. But man, dude, look at that. That is beautiful. A little code card on the back, which does kind of worry me. I can't see the condition of the corners. And, you know, you got to keep at least one sealed, right? You never know. So we'll put that down to the side. We gotta go with, with, with the Mewtwo next. Beautiful card. Same as it is in Japanese. But absolutely stunning. Our uh, our corners don't actually look too bad. There's a little, little nick in that one. And it looks like the cut kinda sucks on it to be honest. But man, the fire card absolute fire card and then this thing dude wow wow like you would expect it to be glossy but it's like it's not it's it's a matte finish it's completely textured all throughout you guys see that dude it just it feels good to hold honestly it feels really good to hold and then of course the back dude that is sick that's like nice and smooth so is the pokemon on both sides you can see, uh, definitely not going to get this one graded. It's already nicked right there. That's not cool. But dude, absolutely. This is awesome. This is, this is awesome. These are freaking sweet. And those off to Ellie so she can check them out. And then here, dude, look, we're going to go like this. Pull all our packs out. I honestly don't remember. I think there's 18, right? 1, 2, 3, 4, 5, 6, 7, 16. 16 packs. So, the deck box. 
the Mew coin, the damage markers, and the counter. The counter. What else is in here? Dude, this this mat. Wow. This is. Look how many times that thing's rolled. All right. Well, I don't have no space to unroll this right now, right? Um, you, you'll probably see it in a future video, right? I like switching out the play mats every now and then. Um, but wow, wow, wow. Cool. So we got an empty box here. We're gonna set this off to the side. This was, this is, these are sweet. These are sweet. We gotta see what the pull rate's like inside of them. You know, let's hope they didn't nerf everything into the ground. But uh, everything else that we saw in that box definitely, definitely felt premium. That, that metal card is absolutely phenomenal. So I am I am looking forward to uh, to seeing the condition of the other ones that we open, honestly. Because, right, the idea is to be able to submit those. PSA accepts them. Uh, the buddy that I have that just submitted a couple of his cards with the last submission, they, uh, all right, we, we, we submitted the, the Pikachu and the Charizard. I'm getting scatterbrained. Boom, here we go. All right, Electabuzz, Rhyhorn, Tangela, Coughing, Daisy, Venomoth, Rapidash, Venomoth again, Gloom, and dude, off the bat, full art Kangaskhan EX. Not too shabby. Not too shabby at all. Pretty cool, right? We have it. We pulled it a couple times, but what a way to start the video, right? And away we go. Dome Fossil, Weedle, Zubat, Golduck, Pinsir, Bill, Staryu, Mankey, and a Flareon. Ooh, with the Psychic Energy with the Swirl. Let's go. All right. Still on the hunt for, you know, probably the top three cards in the set. Oh, I, whoa, it looks like I'm looking at Poke Data, right? Everybody looks at different things. I, I like the way that they have everything set up, but it's looking like Charizard still holding strong. Number one, Erica Invitation, Special Illustration Rare. Speak of her, there she is. Not the one we were looking for, but boom, Venusaur EX. All right. But uh, yeah, Charizard's number one. Price wise, Erica Invitation number two. Looks like the. Special Illustration Rare Blastoise might have gone up a little bit today. Um, oh yeah, Full Art Erica has dropped significantly. Uh, still need the Alakazam, still need the Venusaur. We've got the Charmander, the Charizard EX, the Squirtle, the Mew. Alright, so actually it looks like we have a good amount of the uh, the top cards. <clears throat> but you know, you gotta, you gotta stay on the hunt, right? How else are you gonna get those cards? Let's go. So what what I say? There's 16 packs in here. So we're going to open 32 packs today of 151. Hopefully, hopefully, hopefully we can pull one of those elusive god packs. <clears throat> uh, there's a dude in my office that's pulled one. He is the only person that I know of that has. We've got plenty of chances today. Hopefully it works out in our favor and we can pull one of those bad boys. Um, that would be super cool. I have yet to pull any God Pack out of any set, right? <clears throat> Ooh, Darkness Energy swirled up. All right. Not bad. I am moving a little fast, right? We did take a little while to get through the uh, the unboxing, which I didn't mind. That was, that was phenomenal. Um, the way that they had everything set up. And we still have more packs after this, so... If I'm moving too fast, I apologize. I don't want to keep you guys too long. I just want to see the hits, baby. You know what I mean? That's all I want. We got a full art, an EX, and two hollow energies right now. Uh, it's probably going to get to the point where I'm going to stop counting the energies, right? Those are kind of just like a, a gimme, like a, like a participation trophy, I guess. You know, oh, sorry, you didn't get anything good in your pack. Here's a hollow energy, right? We have all of them. Um, still hunting for one with more than five swirls on it. More than five swirls is what we are looking for. Uh, and yes, I count half swirls. So if any of you guys have any of those energies besides the psychic one that's got more than five swirls on it, I'll let you boy, right? 
we can work something out. Got plenty of cards, plenty of bulk to trade. Yikes, all right. Was that two or three packs in a row, no hits? We are on to the set, the stack that was on the left side of that box. So we're already eight in. Eight in, really only two hits. Venusaur EX, Snuff Full Art, Kangaskhan. Dragonair, Seedra, Kabuto, Electabuzz, Graveler, and a Ditto Hollow. <clears throat> Pardon me, they made us get our flu shot the other day, so got a little bit of a, a little bit of a froggy throat, a little gummed up. <clears throat> Try not to clear my throat in the mic too much. I know it gets annoying. Pidgey, Metapod, Erica, Nidoqueen, Victory Bell, Kabutops, Grimer, and an Electrode. Wow. All right, so um. So uh, we are 10 packs in, no art rares. Um, still holding at the one full art and the EX. So not looking too good right now, honestly. We, we need something to help pick this up. We might need that Moltres for the master set and that's about it out of that pack. Woof. Super excited, guys. Super excited, and it's kind of letting us down right now, right? I know it's luck of the draw, but you'd figure out of, out of all these, there'd be something, right? Rigid Band, Dome Fossil, Diglett, and a Raichu. Okay, well. Oh. Lopoke, Magmar, Horsey, Abra, Erica, Nita Queen, Victory Bell, Rigid Band, No Art Rare. Woof. Okay, well. About to just start skipping to the hits, dude. Well, the lack of hits. Might move a little bit faster that way. Okay, get this out of the way. Uh, energy. Is that swirly at the top? Yep. Swirly at the top. Cool. Ferris, Voltorb, Krabby, Sandshrew, Hypno, Polyrath, Pidgeot, Pharaoh. Nothing there. Nothing there. Okay. Well, I know that as soon as I skip this, something's going to be phenomenal hiding in the back, right? Um, and energy. Okay. We're just going to go like this. We'll keep an extra one there in case there's anything good. Tauros, Kadabra, Oddish, Gloom. I mean, uh, uh, we need the Wigglytuff for the the set right pretty disappointing overall i mean there's one pack in there left right god pack would be cool chances are low but that's actually pathetic two ex's and a full art out of 16 packs of pokemon 151 we're gonna rip this you know we're gonna rip another one just because right so and nothing Cool man, so that first that first UPC sucked. That that sucked hard. 120 bucks for some some dice I'm never gonna use and uh, three cards that probably equal five bucks altogether. Right? I know it's about the uh, the adventure, right? Not the destination, but it would be nice to get something. So give me a minute. We're gonna rip the packs out of the other one and uh, we're gonna go through that and hope that that turns out better because that was abysmal. All right, and we're back, guys. We got another 16 packs. Really hoping that this one turns around. That that first showing was disgusting. It was disgusting. All right. Well, yeah, we don't have time for we don't have time for those types of shenanigans. Let's go. Can we start out better on the first pack? Electrode. Nope. And no. Okay. We got these from GameStop, by the way. Don't know if that really matters. Um, I should have known come into this, right? Our track record with them isn't the best. Um, yeah. <clears throat> we don't usually have good luck. We don't usually buy stuff from over there. Um, 
we do have four UPCs coming in from the Pokemon Center. We can open up one of those and uh, see if there's any see if there's any difference. All right, there we go. We got a Full Art Giovanni's Charisma. Not the special illustration rare, but still pretty solid. Um, still, still Full Art, right? It's better than Kangaskhan. Let's be real, Kangaskhan's probably the worst card that you could pull as a Full Art. <laughs> it's just always been such a useless Pokemon. Onita, Pikachu, Farfetch, Old Amber, Venomoth, Rapidash, Nidorina, Orsi. Dude, what is up? Where where are the art rares? Well, what is going on? I laugh, but I'm dying inside. And nothing. Cool, 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 cool. Swirled up, and there you go, guys. And nothing. All right. Well, you know, I was worried about this video being long, but at this rate, we're gonna be done with these packs in about the next 30 seconds. And, all right, dude, something sussy here. How do we not have a single freaking art rare out of 20 packs? What are you doing, GameStop? What are you doing? Not a single art rare, huh? We got one swirl over there on that darkness energy. There you go, guys. I'm already kind of over this. We are more than halfway now. We have a single pull, not a, whoa, it took 20 packs, but there we go, Jesus. The Poliwhirl, probably one of the best art rares in the set, in my opinion. Beautiful card, He's just hanging out, looking at himself, reflecting on the meaning of life. Beautiful card, absolutely beautiful card. Um, yeah, wow, all right. <clears throat> I mean, at least, at least we got to display, you know, the stuff in the box, right? That's <laughs> probably been the best part of this whole video. And an Alakazam, cool. Okay. Man, dude, feels almost like I'm opening up a freaking MJ Holdings product, right? <clears throat> Out of all these packs, I can't believe, man. This is like the worst showing of 151 we've ever had. And it's funny because it's the most expensive opening of 151 we've ever had. So, uh, well, last two packs. Looks like at this rate, it'll be under 20 minutes or right on the dot. So here we go, guys. Last pack. If you like what you saw, you know, the, the, some of the cards that you, I actually went slow enough for you guys to see, uh, leave a little like. Wow, look at that. Last pack and we pulled his app This is the third time we pulled this card. Um, while it is cool, I would <clears throat> I would like to pull something else at some point, you know. But there you go, guys. Last code card. That's all I got for you guys today. Thanks for watching. I'll catch you in the next one.